ओके वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग सो वी आर गोइंग टू सी टुडे इन दिस सेकंड टॉपिक द कंट्रीब्यूशन ऑफ इंडियन फाइकोलॉजिस्ट इन द डेवलपमेंट ऑफ द फाइकोलॉजी फाइकोलॉजी मीन्स रिलेटेड विद दैट ऑफ द स्टडी ऑफ और द इंडियन रिसर्चर्स स्टार्टेड देयर वर्क इन द अलगी and they are generally up to the 1919 onwards so there are it is very uh, pleasurable thing that so we have the number of scientists are there in our indian region and they have studied the different uh, uh, types for example uh, ghosh from 1919 to 1932 so they are carried on the observations on the blue green algae of the burma and the punjab part is uh, region is there then later uh, later mop iyengar he is the authority generally uh, in this one and their students bal krishnan desikachari ramnathan and subramanya so out of these three uh, scientists bal krishnan desikachari and subramanya uh, we are the head of department of department of botany so uh, as they have done the maximum work in this one and their students are the professor p b chowdhury sir from our university so we will see the one by one later so we will uh, give the first weightage to dr professor m o p ayenga so as their main uh, name is there mandian osuri uh, parthasarathi parthasarathi so m o p its short form ayenga from 1886 to 1963 so see the period they born in the madras and started their research in the phycology especially on the hollow tails we are knowing the genus hollow is there so this order firstly studied by the our indian scientists hollow tails the great algologist f e fritch was the guide of remoki uh, ayengar sir and for the algal studies in at the london so they have taken the guidance from the uh, fritch we are knowing the fritch system of classification so their work uh, is there he worked on the life history of cylindro capsa then uh, microdiction uh, uh, species and he discovered new species of the like fritchi ella so they have given the name to this species uh, in honor of their the guide uh, fritch right so fritchi ella then gilbert Uh, Gilbert Smithia, then Egg Bello Cystopsis, and the uh, Cara Seo Siphon. So these are their new uh, species are there. Then for his contribution in the field of phycology, he is called as father of modern phycology of India. Modern phycology of India. So this is the short introduction. Then you see the this fish is the genus. So as it shows the Uh, uh, these uh, like structures are there. Fish here, la branch structure, and uh, so in the uh, occurring in the uh, some uh, fresh water. Then this is the Kara Siphon. It is the I think it is having the colonial, but having a specific type of the nature. Then in contribution, he was the president of Phycology Society of India, and his huge collection of specimens. herbariums generally hand over to the department of botany university of the madras now recently uh, it is called as chennai so his collection is there i think uh, uh, we have seen at our student level in 1986 when we have visited to the uh, chennai madras right so his collection is very good then uh, uh, tharampura Vedanta Desikachari. So they are born in the Tirupati, and he uh, he gave the report to the unpublished paper of M O P Ayenga. So these are the Desikachari, their students. So they were also the uh, head of department of our university botany department. Then uh, uh, their contribution uh, to our knowledge of the South Indian algal study is done by the. basic acharya sir 
in contribution of uh, their mainly as they published a large number of research papers as monograph on cyanophyta taxonomy and biology of blue green algae then marine plants and hollow kelps then he published a rhodophyta and phyophyta monumental atlas of indian diatoms in five volumes so like this one he made the critical study on life history of the red algae so red algae is the main their work also then desikachari sir they have given the new genera to the algae as ayangirella then ayangirella uh, monas then uh, shilario monas mantoniella and the roselia so these are their new genera he was the chief editor of phycos it is the journal uh, international journal and they are the chief editor then phycological society of america honored him for his lifetime contribution in the phycology then his massive algal collections are even today present in the university of the madras or the chennai so these are the some genera manto nearla it is like this one then uh, third authority is there why bharadwaj so uh, yajna olleka bharadwaj completed the, his phd from the university of london and was the hod of botany in the uh, bhu bhu uh, uh, in uh, generally the, it is uh, famous and uh, they are the held the more contribution so at the uh, school of the algal studies it is they have developed there then he discovered the drapenal diopsis we are also taking this example nowadays but see how is the arrangement and lateral branching is there from the nodal point is there the two species of cytonematesi uh, spasilopogon kashepi and the cytonema malimiensis uh, so these are the two species uh, discovered by the bharadwashtar then ms randava from 1932 to 59 so Mohinder Singh Randhawa was born in the Punjab and he got selected in the ICS Indian Civil Service he was one of the chief editor of the Phycos then contribution of Randhawa sir he published series of papers in Jigni uh, Messi Matesi Odogonials and the Vaucheriaceae he recorded 70 species of Jigni Messi uh, in 2005 then he discovered new species such as uh, zygogonium cumiaonensi then urocladium himalayensis and chignima terrestri then uh, after randwasar arin singh the ram nagina singh was the student of bharadwaj sir and studied in the bhu so he was credited for his work on the cyanobacteria and it was the agricultural field then uh, he discovered alocera uh, fertilissima his contribution is there he described the life history of fresella tuberosa and the drapenal diopsis indica he is also known for his work on the reclamation of user land in india reclamation so wetlands uh, generally develop uh, into the fertile land then in conclusion we may say that the scope of mycology in india it is uh, due to the more species were discovered in the latter years and the achievements of mycology is uh, generally related to that of the certain research is there so here there are some references are there so textbook of algae then uh, sambati murti in 2008 textbook of algae uh, then uh, different websites are also there so this is the uh, these are the some our indian then uh, one of my teacher and the main algal study at the university of pune department of botany so professor bb saugle sir 
they are the they were as the excel department of botany so they have in the number of research papers but alien study is the main their interest so they have in the different uh, studies and uh, in view of the medicinal also so sargassum species or the certain uh, contain modulation effect of sulfated polysaccharides with reference to on the porphyra marine algae are there then uh, there are the certain algal polysaccharides detection as a marine source so then fatty composition of the cold water in inhabiting fresh water red algae so these are the, then batrachus formum was uh, interesting point of sir so we are the student of professor chowle sir and uh, they have also taught us very nicely the algal study so i have also included there they have also reported some endangered and extinct seaweeds in the indian shores our uh, maharashtrian part uh, western shore generally is mainly studied by the chowle sir then morphological differences are there then they have also studied the kara caro caropites in the state of maharashtra so this uh, their student is sir patil sir now they are the head of department at bharati vidyapeeth so uh, just i am giving a list of their research papers are there so maximum work is uh, done by the so will sir then also related with the biology ecology and the pharmaceutical nowadays uh, so will sir they are engaged with the reliance group for uh, generally for the detection of the uh, this crude oil from the ocean and the study of the different diatoms or the uh, unicellular forms are there uh, from at from the bottom of the this so like the we are knowing the giant kelp is there or algal blooms are there so like this one this study is also interesting part of the chowle sir so thanks to all our next lecture we are going to now start the one by one uh, classes are there so we will see firstly on the cyanophyta okay so thanks to all good day